Good afternoon. It is Friday, June 26th, and uh, I'm here with some scripture and a prayer for today. Our scripture reading today is from Proverbs chapter 2, verses 1 to 5. My child, if you accept my words and treasure up my commandments within you, making your ear attentive to wisdom and inclining your heart to understanding, if you indeed cry out for insight and raise your voice for understanding, if you seek it like silver and search for it as for hidden treasures, then you will understand the fear of the Lord and find the knowledge of God. May he bless these words to our understanding. The prayer I am going to be reading today is written by Elizabeth Baxter, and it's from Warner's book, Acorns and Archangels. Let us pray. God of grace, you call us to live by grace. Teach us how to do so in our personal lives, in our community, in the wider world, through our mutual love, so freedom. God of peace, you call us to be peacemakers. Teach us how to do so in our personal lives, in our community, in the wider world, through our mutual love, so freedom. God of wisdom, you call us to be wise. Teach us how to be so in our personal lives, in our community living, in the wider world, through our mutual love, so freedom. God of gentleness, you call us to be gentle. Teach us how to be so, in our personal lives, in our community living, in the wider world, through our mutual love, so freedom. God of creation, you call us to be creative. Teach us how to be so, in our personal lives, in our community living, in the wider world, through our mutual love, so freedom. God of generosity, you call us to be generous. Teach us how to be so, in our personal lives, in our community living, in the wider world, through our mutual love, so freedom. God of love, you call us to be loving. Teach us how to be so, in our personal lives, in our community living, in the wider world, through our mutual love, so freedom. God of passion, you call us to be passionate for justice. Teach us how to be so, in our personal lives, in our community living, in the wider world, through our mutual love, so freedom. Amen. And may God be with you through the rest of this day and the weekend, and we hope that you will join us on Sunday morning for our regular worship service at 10.30 EST, 9.30 Northwestern Ontario. Shalom.